Hello Aquarius and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week ahead of April 30th through May 6th. Um, I do want to make one announcement. Well, first my emails, they're getting fixed. There are, they are better. It's still a little bit of a mess, but it's getting better. But I do want to say that I will not be doing private readings till after May 13th. I am going out of town attending my wedding. It's my wedding. <laughs> so I'm getting married. Um, so please note if you do order a um a private reading it will not be scheduled till after the 13th um i'm going to try to pre-record the general readings and have them out um next week too so i'm really getting busy trying to pre-record and that's kind of hard because i like to focus you have to focus really heavy when you're doing things ahead of time too so, yeah. Okay, so let's get on with your reading here. Now I see some frustration, maybe stress, could be worry. It's a little bit in the yellow. Um, I see maybe it's possibly a bit of stress over money for some. Um, like an example would be maybe you want to buy something, but you may not have the means to afford it. Something like that. That's just an example. Definitely double check your funds. You don't want any surprises with money. Um, and that's going to actually give you a wake up call maybe or taking a hard look at like the disparity between what you spend money on and what you actually even value. Okay. I see some nice advanced ideas coming through. That's great. Um, I see making some discoveries and also a sense of freedom is showing up too, okay? There's some, it's like there's some learning some things. This is learning more about yourself, okay? Self-discoveries too. Also, I see that some of you may be learning a valuable lesson from someone that could be older than you. This could be like your uh, an older relative or someone who has great wisdom. So that is showing up too. Your hopes is um, showing up too and reevaluating, you know, like what does your, your, your soul, your spirit need for you to change some things? Maybe it's connected with your career, work, um, your reputation, um, how you are seen by others, what worked, what didn't, things like that. Um, it's like you're trying to change it to clear it up, you know, start a clean slate, so to say. Um, definitely listen to your intuition. You have high energy here. So listen to your intuition and your practicality or logical side too. Okay. It's like, what do you see yourself in the world? How do you see yourself? What do others see? It's like, that's uh, the energy I'm seeing here too. You could be a little bit more vulnerable now than usual. Um, but don't worry about it. You know, for some of you, it's like, it's good to express yourself or even show this vulnerable side of yours because you have um, ones around you that will love it and open their, uh, themselves to you and support you. So that's one message that maybe someone needed to hear. Yeah. Okay. So on the plate. Yeah. You know, there. it's a mixed energy here. So I'm going to try to explain one thing here. There can be deception around you. There could be someone who um, lies to you. Okay, I do see that energy. But for others, it's split or that that you should, again, be a, reassessing your surroundings. Okay, so that's one thing. But there is a sense of self-deception and denial. Okay, so it's like you need to take a look at something and um, be honest with yourself is what I'm trying to say. Um, I do see a turn of events happening, okay? There can be some anxiety um, with that too. I do see, you know, judging your surroundings, judging um, yourself, judging a lot of things. And it's it's really encourageable to do that. Making some judgment calls for the future, okay? So that's looking good. It's like starting a clean slate in some areas, okay? So that's what's coming through um, here, Matters of the heart, they could be uh, decisions to make with love. Love is definitely in focus, okay, and moving forward with it. It's pretty good for most very good energy here, too. What I also see is 
your goals and your aspirations are going to come to a climax, okay? And it can be connected to um, family and even property matters, okay? Being a part of this. Yep. Well, Aquarius, that was your reading for the week ahead of um, April 30th through May 6th. Like I said, I will be resuming private readings after May 13th. And uh, yeah, I hope you have a wonderful week and I'll catch you back next week for your next Coffee Cup reading. Until then, all the best. Bye for now.